As an outdoor worker, you can't avoid the sun. It's part of your working day. You've likely heard how important it is to wear sunscreen and protect yourself at the beach, but you may have given it little thought while actually working outdoors. Unlike the weekend beach crowd, you are working outside every day, all week. This ongoing daily exposure increases the chance of you getting too much sun on your skin. With the number of people getting skin cancer each year going up, it's important to understand that the risk of getting skin cancer can be greatly reduced. And that's good news for anyone who must work outdoors on a regular basis. An easy way to lower your risk is to make some simple changes in the way you work outdoors. Seek shade whenever possible. Although this may not be easy to do all the time, choose to work in the shade when you can. This is even more important in the summer and at midday. Here are some tips. Outside jobs can sometimes be done inside or moved to a new location that is in the shade or under cover. Put up a temporary shelter or use trees and buildings for shade. Try to work in very sunny areas earlier or later in the day when the sun isn't as strong. Rotate workers when there is no choice but to work in midday sun. The less exposure to harmful rays, the less danger you face. Cover up. Skin covered by clothes will usually not need any other protection. Long sleeve shirts or long pants give you the best protection. Choosing a shirt with a collar is a good idea since it will cover the skin on the back of the neck. And while you're covering your skin, don't forget to protect your eyes with good sunglasses. Put on a hat. Two out of three skin cancers appear on the face, head, and neck. Protect these areas, including the ears and any bald spots on the head, by wearing a broad brim hat, more than eight centimeters or three inches, or a hat with a brim and flap down the back. A hard hat can have a flap or an extra brim fitted to it. You can even wear a back flap with a baseball cap. Make sure the tips of your ears are covered. Wear sunscreen. Use a broad spectrum sunscreen with an SPF of 30 or higher. A broad spectrum sunscreen protects against UVA and UVB rays, which are both harmful to your skin. Look for the words recognized by the Canadian Dermatology Association on the label, and be sure to apply enough to achieve the full sun protection factor or SPF protection, you need a generous amount. Most people use only half of what they need. Put it on all areas that will be in the sun, including the face, neck, ears, arms, and back of the hands. Do this before going out into the sun, and don't forget to put on more after doing hard work. Sunscreen washes away when you sweat. If you're outside all day, a lunch break would be a good time to reapply. And remember, sunscreens do not block all ultraviolet radiation and should not be used to stay in the sun longer. Sunscreen simply offers you protection when you must be outdoors.